Legendary Troops Part 34 Talk Druid. Now, I want to tell you one thing. I'm not sure have you guys seen this um, troop uh, tier list which is available online um, when Talk Druid is like S, plus, which I think that's the top class. Uh, I'm gonna give him very weak gold and let me explain you why my points of view. Uh, his average attack and average um, defense. He's porting on the, on the back of, um, of the enemies and he's poisoning them and he stuns them. Now the angle of the other list was that he stuns them for five seconds and you know I play a couple of months this game, I play a couple of months um, playing with Toad Druid. I don't own the character myself but um, I was playing it very often in Chambers of Destiny and it's all in gameplay so you can see how that goes. Um, you need to have several, I think it was I've experienced once when the game had like a three or four units when they actually made me stun for a moment that I've noticed that. Um, otherwise we look through the prism of free to play players, uh, people who you have to have that skill developed, that's the third skill um, of that character. So it has to be five out of five in order to make it uh, five seconds long. You know how it goes with up up updating all the skills. So through the prism of the majority of people and uh, not the absolute spenders who can dump some money and get just you know 20 of those units and then play with them um, accordingly um, it's a gold one because it's a good unit if you combine them with any back attack unit it will increase the the, the successfulness the, the, the it will increase the chances for your attack to become successful so it sounds non-official and stuff um, but ultimately um, gold tier due to the fact that it's a legendary unit it won't be so available to a majority of people and again in order to enjoy all those skills you have to really build them up and that takes time and effort therefore gold i'll see you in part 35